ones. I know it's going to be bad. Oh, what the heck? It's not even. The eggs didn't even hatch. No. Oh! <laughs> oh, the baby is <laughs> cute. <laughs> Twins. Yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, you want to pick up my fingers? <laughs> you want to try foods? Oh, twins. They're so cute. Gotta give them back to mommy, Katie. <laughs> I don't even know who you're from. We're sweet. That's all I can say. You want to my zipper? You're so grown up already. <laughs> what a cool, cool coloring. You're gonna be my friend because I get to hold you for my baby. <laughs> oh my god. That is just so freaking cute. Mm -hmm. Hi. <laughs> get rid of mommy. Cool and eagle. Bubble. Oh, poop. <laughs> Where's poops? You're trying to get me from behind. Yep. Today's been a bit rainy and uh, it's been really nice to actually just relax inside the bus and throw on a Skillshare class. And Skillshare is a sponsor of today's video. Skillshare is an online learning community with thousands of classes and new ones are added each week. Today I've been focused on Romanticizing Your Life, a beginner's guide to vlogging by Carrie Cakes. She's another content creator here on YouTube. She does really awesome travel vlogs. Her class has been really interesting. She has a really cool way of interacting, I guess you could say, through the camera. And she's had some really great tips on vlogging and kind of like planning out exactly what you want to film so that you can produce a great vlog in the end. The cool thing with Skillshare is there's a tab on each class where you can have a discussion with the creator or other people taking the class and I just think that's really cool when you're 
doing something that's online based, having that opportunity to connect with other people that are interested in the same thing as you. If you're interested in joining us over at Skillshare, we are offering the first thousand people to use our code or the link down in our description, a free month trial. So go check it out and thanks to Skillshare for sponsoring today's video. Well, it's been very exciting here having some new little chickens hatching. We actually had a third one hatch last night and so now we have three brand new little babies and it's actually kind of cool seeing the two that hatched the day earlier. They seem older but you can really tell the difference between the brand new one and those two. They are just super adorable. I'm trying to handle them a lot because I just love them. <laughs> but I'm going to be working on getting their little nursery pen fixed up and Greg is working on his chainsaw, getting ready to clean up some logs. So I got the little nursery done, it started raining so I had to run the camera inside. But I've got two little sections. I'm gonna have, uh, we have another broody hen. So I'm gonna put her on one side and then I'm gonna put the little babies and Stormy the hen in the other side. And they can just do their thing. Um, I'm kinda hoping that if I have the broody hen in here <laughs> that nobody will be bothering her trying to lay eggs on her nest as much as I know she wants more eggs in her nest, but we gotta keep them all on the same timeline, so. Pooey, it's a beautiful sunny day out, Pooh. 
is What are we up to? We're pulling some logs up the mountain, Katie. Can't you tell? Well, that's what we're doing, pulling up logs. It's the last couple logs that we gotta get pulled up here and then we're gonna push the stumps down. We're kind of thinking like if the stumps build up over time, it'll eventually be kind of like a little flat bench and we can have a picnic down here or something. Um, of course, that's gonna be a long time, but you know, it's, it's an idea. Eleven minutes later. Get those stumps down there.
horse feet. I want horse feet. Yeah, 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 yeah. I want horse feet because I'm a fat bull. The goats have reached the adolescence age where they don't want to listen to us. So, listen to horse treats. but they are very food motivated. So, <laughs> <laughs> I did this naked once. I did not take a video of it. It was terrifying. Here. So that's how we uh, bribed them to go inside. <laughs> Psycho. So we've pushed the stumps as far as we can with the tractor and I have an idea to put a stick between the stump or a board between the stumps and the bucket of the tractor and kind of like push it down with that so <laughs> yes. so we'll see how it goes I'm gonna put the camera on the tripod because Greg's gonna need my help for this Well, it's looking so much better around here. Got, got a ton of cleanup. We did a big dump run. The only thing we have left are these old propane tanks and the broken fridge that we had in the bus originally. So next up for today is going to be getting the trailer ready because we need to use it and it's not quite roadworthy. So Greg is going to be welding on the uh, wheel well covers, I guess. Is that what they're called? Yep. <laughs> Never-ending generator problems. Yeah, this one's been trouble from the first, from the get-go. I don't know if there's anyone else watching our videos that lives off-grid. 
that is constantly having generator problems. We've been through so many generators and they just, I don't, I don't understand why we have so many problems. I've tried out the Energizer, the Westinghouse. The Westinghouse was actually pretty good. I don't, what happened to that one? Dirty power. That's what our, our inverted did not like. Oh, it. right. The inverter didn't like it. No. So we got this Energizer one. It's, uh, doesn't like starting anymore. <laughs> no. So Greg will usually spend 10 minutes pulling on the cord trying to get it to start, and I can't even do it myself. It's frustrating. <sighs> yeah. Generators. <laughs> but I think it'll work for what we need. Just don't stand on the flat fenders, on the flares, okay. on the wheel wells. <laughs> anyway. Fuck, I, I think it's actually like, I, I can't get this thing started. But I got the other one on. Don't look at it. <laughs> get this close so I can weld it. It was no good, Katie. All right, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. And if you enjoyed the video, please hit the thumbs up and leave a comment down below. Let us know where you're watching from. We will see you all next week from a very secret location. We are going on an adventure, so it's gonna be really fun. And uh, have a great week, everyone.